Okay, and we're back, and I can't remember why I was here. Cables! I was here because of cables. Let's make some more cables. That's not gonna be enough cables. That will be, though. <laughs> I guess we are making a solar array up here after all. I just have to try and get it in uh, in line with the center of this circle, because otherwise my OCD is gonna fucking kill me. There we go, this should all start generating power. Now all I have to do, go down the same hole as I did over there. So you know what, let's just run cable. We don't even have to hide it, because this is meant to be the tech area. There we go, this thing should now be receiving power. It's not receiving power. Why not? Is there a specific port I have to plug you into? Do I need a fucking adapter? Hello? Hello? Why are you not charging? Hello? Is there a specific face I have to use? Is there a specific face I have to use? It better not be the back one. It better not be the fucking back one. It's not looking like it's the underneath one, which means it might be the fucking back one. Whatever, we can deal with that when the time comes for us to need to. Uh, next, we need to collect the materials for the pump. Now, the, they weren't actually all that hard to get. It's 16 gold, which we've got on us, so if we just... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Uh, then the next one was uh, 48 iron, which we don't have on us, but we can just go and grab from the computer. Yep, 48 iron right up there in the uh, inventory. Then it was uh, a stack of redstone dust, which, again, we don't have in the computer, but I have 19 on me, and we have a farm of EMC outside. So we can just throw that stack in like that, and that's enough to give us a mining well. Oh, I see. So you click it, and then it, like, charges, and as the line goes up, I'm guessing it takes takes the power then. Uh, either way, we don't want the mining well. I don't even know what that does, to be completely honest. Um, what we need now is 512 glass. <laughs> Fucking hell, that's a lot of glass. Uh, so that is one stack, two stack, three stack, four stack, five, that's like six, seven stacks? Hold on, 512 divided by 64, that's... And then carry the carry the four. Um, eight. Why was that so hard for me? It's eight stacks of glass. Well, that's freaky. Where the hell did I even get an ambience disc from? But yeah, so if we now give it the eight stacks of glass it wanted, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. With 43 left over. All that's left now is to give it 80 cactus, which is really really fucking weird thing to ask for but okay but yeah either way so here's 64 65 6 7 8 9 70 and then it needs another 10 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 let's keep the other 48 because cactus is really hard to find for some reason chuck that up there and that should be everything it's still still telling me to get a mining world plus did i miss something 16, 48, 64, 512, 80. No, that, that, that's, that's the correct recipe. And it's definitely got enough power. So why, why is it making me get the mining well? That's weird. That's really weird. Part of me thinks maybe it's trying to get me to get this first, but also if it is, I really, I mean, if it isn't, I really don't want to get it and then be stuck having to collect the materials again. Uh, is there something that I'm missing? Okay, apparently this is just really fucking buggy. And the solution is to add an additional stack of redstone, then take it out and the pump should appear. Don't you just love it when mods, passion projects, built purely because the creator has a want and a need for the functionality. Just don't fucking work for some reason. Don't you just fucking love it? When the whole purpose of something's existence doesn't even work properly. Story of my fucking life. Okay, so they said add an extra stack of redstone, take the mining well plus, or I guess craft the mining well plus. Where has the connection gone? Why are you like this? I've just had a thought. I, I, I've just had a thought. What am I doing? I do this every single time. Hang on. Uh, wait, what? Uh, what the... 
Why does it work? What? Why? Who designed you? Why were you made like this? What? 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 Huh? Hello? How are you? Nice to meet you? What the fuck? What is happening? Why? What? I don't understand. You, you needed 27,000. That's it. Why do you keep going up and down and then into the negatives? I don't get it. Why are you taking a hundred thousand? You don't need that much. You need at the most three, three hundred and twenty thousand. But that's not even for this one. This needs a hundred and sixty thousand. You've had that several times over. Uh, what? I just. What? I just. I just. I just want something in this mod pack to work right for once. That's all I want. Just once. Just fucking once. I want Anadonia to work without any crashes or bugs or weird fucking glitches like this. Is that too much to ask for? Am I being un? reasonable to ask that just for once when I open up the mod pack or the server or the fucking mod list or hell the replay mod recording files is it too much to ask that just for once it works and that's it no withouts or withs or it works and there's also this or it works in spite of this I just want something to fucking work without extra work having to be put in is that too much to ask for oh this fucking mod pack genuinely drives me insane fuck okay we're nearly done we're, we're nearly there just got a tiny tiny bit left come on take over I've watched three videos. It's taken three videos to get this far. Thanks. I... I... <laughs> well, that clearly didn't work. Oh, that's... That's great. That's so good. I am so thrilled. Oh. So by removing it and placing it, the the pump plus has now arrived. Great. So now if I just click cl uh what Wh how can I just how do you need negative 11,000? <laughs> and it's gonna make me wait another 30 minutes. <laughs> uh. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, I've been waiting for uh, 28 minutes now. It's just decided to fucking crash again. I, 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 I love this game. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> and we're nearly there. Finally, <laughs> it has been 45 minutes. Oh, I spent 45 minutes waiting for a pump. I could have just used this. Why was I bored? Well, either way, now that we have the pump and now that we have the ender tank, we can just start setting things up. So... I think the best way to go about this would be to just plunk it on the side of one of these obsidian pillars, so... Ooh, dimensional shards, hello. Ooh, ooh, cobalt, hello. So if we put the pump here, and then we put the ender tank on top, like, no... Like that... What? How do we turn this thing on? I'm guessing maybe just a redstone... Uh, a redstone signal? 
Either that or it's gonna need a generator, which, I mean, we're in the nether. It's not like we can't just use exothermic uh, power generation. Did I throw my redstone torch out? I, I swear to God, if I threw my redstone torch out. I threw my redstone torch out. Okay, let's... Let's go grab something to power this with. You know what? That redstone block there looks absolutely delicious. Let's use that, shall we? This is just a guess, by the way. I have complete faith in the fact that this just isn't going to work and I'm going to need a generator. And let's see how quickly this fails. Very quickly. Very, very quickly. Okay, so if it's not a redstone contact that it requires, then it does need some form of power. Now, this is from Quarry Plus. However, as far as I'm aware, Quarry Plus doesn't actually have a generator that you can build in survival. It has the creative generator, but as, it, as you can clearly see... That's creative only! Yay! And it also doesn't say that it requires any sort of power anyway. So, let's just try and figure this out, shall we? Let's just try and figure this out. Power cables don't even connect. That bodes well. Well, if cables don't work, I'm gonna have to assume that I need to stick it directly next to a generator. So, let's... Let's look at the types of generators we can use. If there's one powered by lava... I mean, we could just create a third ender tank and make it self-sufficient, but I, I don't think that'd work very well. We need a heat generator. We need something that can work based on heat. We need thermoelectricity. Uh, oh, that's a massive engineering. That's an entirely different mod. Um, I mean, we do have a spare combustion generator, but... Hold on, you can make a fucking slipstream generator? I could use this to get off planet. This is... But this is modern artifice. What? Why the fuck does the magic mod have a fucking slipstream slip generator? <laughs> Who looked at magic and thought, I know, let me tear open a fucking space time wormhole? Actually, you know what? That does sound like something magic would do. Right, either way, I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's get a combustion generator. Let's get a spare condenser. Let's get one of those fucking. Uh, energy collectors, and then a, uh, 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 some coal. Right, we've got a plan, let's go see it through. Okay, so step one would be to grab one of these, step two would be to grab one of these, step three would be to grab one of these. Right then, now step four would be to grab some coal, so let's see if we've got any spare. We have a block of coal, which, you know what, that can be turned into nine coal. So it's good enough. Now all we need are item transfer pipes. Now, I know these are about as reliable as... That's a fluid cable. Where did the item transfer pipes go? What did I do with them? I must have deleted them then, because they're not in the chest here either. Well, what I was going to say is I know the item transfer pipes from uh, Cyclic are about as reliable as using a sieve to fucking move water. Um, but... I was going to use them anyway because it was a short distance they needed to go and it was nearly impossible for them to fuck it up. But I think I deleted them just because they were that useless. So we need to make some more item transfer pipes. Preferably ones that actually work this time. So looking into JEI, if we just look for item, we should be able to find item transfer pipes. So we can either go with none of these because there's literally no transfer options available there. Okay, let's try for transfer pipes. Energy transfer node, item transfer. Ooh, wireless transmission of items. You know what? That's not... We could... Uh, I don't want to go through the effort of getting the crystallized amber again. Fuck that. What happened to all of our cables? What happened to the item transfer pipes? Where the, where the fuck have they gone? Seriously. Unless we want to use creative, it looks like we're going to have to use these. So, um, I don't know. Do we have any brick? Can we make some brick? Do we have any clay? We've got a lot of clay. Let's, uh, let's make some brick, I guess. There we go. And with those two extra brick, we should be able to then make some brick stairs. And if we drop the brick stairs back in the computer, we then should have, uh, we don't have enough iron nuggets and we don't have any iron in the computer anymore because i put it all in my backpack because i'm just smart like that let's grab a single ingot that we can then turn into nuggets that we can then shove into the computer that we can then use to make the item transfer pipes we don't even need eight realistically i'm pretty sure we only need fucking one of the things but 
who cares? Right, I doubt it's gonna fuck up, but this is the cyclic item cable, so... If anything could fuck this up, it's the cyclic, I cyclic item cable. Oh god damn it, I forgot to grab the fucking combustion engine! If this episode doesn't get demonetized for the amount of times I've sworn, I don't know what will. By the way, YouTube. It's not a fucking challenge, by the way. Just, just, just so you know, okay? <laughs> not a fucking challenge. And then, after that, all we should need to do is grab the item cable. It is genuinely just a one-block movement. There is no way you should be able to fuck this up. But, you know, fingers crossed. And then we just go... Uh, oh, wait, hang on. I've got to land for this, haven't I? It's one... No, it's not. It's... Ah! I'm on fire. Wow, who'd have thought flying this close over lava is dangerous? Genuinely fucking mind-boggling. Uh, coal in the top, and that should immediately be transferred into the combustion engine, which it is. But the combustion engine's storing power, which means it's not transferring into the pump. Come on, is it because of this? Do I have to pump the fluid out? Uh, nope, still empty. Which, I'm, I'm guessing it means that this isn't receiving power, so what if I... Still nothing. Okay, what if I move the position of the tank? No! Still nothing! How interesting. I've got to be doing this wrong. What if I put... No, because the output would come off the top. How do you work a pump plus? Let me... Let me consult the archives. You know what? I have decided that I would rather than figure out how this uh, mod works. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to be very brave and controversial here. I'm going to grab the pump plus uh, that I spent genuinely an hour uh, trying to make and collect and the sort. I'm going to take all of this stuff, really. All of it is going to go into my backpack. So I'm just going to go da 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 and throw it all in my backpack. And then I'm even going to take the item cable and I'm going to take the combustion generator. And do you know what I'm going to do? Do you know what I'm going to do instead of wasting my time on a mod that can't even be bothered to do the very basics of what it was designed to do. I'm gonna use the create mod, like any sane fucking person would have from the beginning. With the create mod, this'll never even run out, because this is classed as an infinite lava source. Whereas with Quarry Plus, I know from experience it turns the lava into cobblestone, meaning you'd have to keep moving it. This is just objectively the better choice. The only thing we've got left to do is to make sure that this thing doesn't unload, and the easiest way to do that is built in to the, to the mod pack. All I have to do is claim these chunks and then claim them again and force load them. Now they are permanently loaded, no matter where I am. All I've got to do now, I can go back to the overworld, and back in the shit shack, as you can see, this thing is, or was, filling up very much nearly to completion. But as you can see, it has stopped and is empty, which means that... That chunk loader, you know, the one that's built into the mod pack? Haha! <laughs> doesn't fucking work! You have to be in the dimension for the chunks to be loaded! Seems to me that that almost defeats the purpose of having a fucking chunk loader! <laughs> Don't you just love it when that happens? Or is it just not sucking? From the looks of it, it's just not sucking. Which is confusing because this... It's supposed to be an infinite lava source. Okay, that's interesting. I wonder why it isn't classed as an infinite lava source. It should be. That might be why, question mark? It shouldn't be why. I'm not sure how to fix this now. By all accounts, this should be working. I don't suppose it'd help if I just did this, right? This can't be the answer, surely. No fucking way. Was that actually the ac the answer? Was that really the solution? You ca you cannot be serious. All right. Well, it's still pumping. There's no signs of it stopping. So I'm gonna go check on the overworld. Uh oh. It's still getting lava every now and again. It's slow, very slow. But that, I think that's just because it's constantly feeding into here. Yeah, it's going up based on miller buckets. It's a lot slower than I would have hoped for, but it's working. Nice. Right then, well, that's task one <laughs> done um, of things that I've always wanted to get done. The second one 
uh, has to do with a lot of agricultural stuff. I think I'll I think I'll do this last one because it is a very easy one. And then I will call it there. The second one that I've always wanted to get done was more agricultural. It was setting up the golden apple farm i there they are because there is a specific type of tree in this mod pack the mystery wood log if i am not mistaken that farms golden apples you break the leaves and it drops gapples combine that with create mods ability to create insane fucking tree farms and even without the emc chest we just have infinite golden apples which is of course a very tasty but i think i'm gonna leave that to the next episode technically i have another five hours or so that i could use to be recording but this mod pack makes me want to so let's move on to the outro but yes with the main two tasks for today finished which was uh step one uh finish the power stuff uh with the shield generators and step two which was finally uh build a system that allows us to have infinite lava in our um furnace which has stopped again i'm gonna call an end to today's video so come on manic ruby manic canoe manic newbie Mechanubi. But remember, if you did enjoy this series of videos, make sure to leave a like down below. Make sure to leave a comment. To tell me what you thought about that video, or this video, or these videos. If I'm being properly grammatically correct, why can I not do anything right? Make sure to hit that subscribe button to be notified whenever I upload. But yes, with all of that lovely goodness out of the way, in case I don't see you, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and good night. And I will see you in the next video. Bye bye